Hello, how to solve for s in this equation? s to the power of 6 is equal to 8 to the power of 6. Solution. Then we have x to the power of 6 is equal to 8 to the power of 6. And this is s to the power of 6 minus 8 to the power of 6 is equal to 0. Then s to the power of 6 can be written as a to the power of 3 square minus 8 to the power of 6 can be written as 8 to the power of 3 square is equal to 0. Then this is in the form of perfect square. That is, if you have a square minus b square, this is equal to a plus b bracket a minus b then this can be written as s to the power of 3 plus 8 to the power of 3 bracket s to the power of 3 minus 8 to the power of 3 is equal to 0 because from here a is equal to s to the power of 3 and b is equal to 8 to the power of 3. Then there are two cases here. The first case is s to the power of 3 plus 8 to the power of 3 is equal to 0. And the second case is s to the power of 3 minus 8 to the power of 3 is equal to zero now let's consider this from the first case here we have s to the power of 3 plus h to the power of 3 is equal to zero now take note of this that if you have a to the power of 3 plus b to the power of 3 this is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a square minus a b plus b square then here we have s plus a bracket a square minus eight s plus 8 square is equal to 0. There are two cases here. The first case is S plus 8 is equal to 0. And second case is S square minus 8S plus 8 square 64 is equal to 0. Now here we have s is equal to minus 8 this is the first value of s here then here this is a quadratic equation let's solve this using quadratic general formula s is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a and from this equation here a is equal to 1 b is equal to minus 8 c is equal to 64 s is equal to minus bracket minus 8 plus or minus square root of minus 8 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 64 divided by 2 multiply by 1 then s is equal to 8 plus or minus this can be written as minus a square we have 64 minus 4 multiply by 64 over 2 then this is 8 plus or minus here is square root of 64 bracket 1 minus 4 
over two. Then we have s is equal to h over two plus or minus square root of sixty four. That is h over two. Then root one minus four. That is minus three. Two year one two year four. Two year one two year four. S is equal to four plus or minus. We know that square root of minus one is i. Then we have four i root three. This is the value of s also from the first case. Now let's consider the second case, which is this. s to the power of 3 minus a to the power of 3 is equal to 0. Then from the second, we have s to the power of 3 minus a to the power of 3 is equal to 0. Take note of this, that if you have a to the power of 3 minus b to the power of 3, this is equal to a minus b bracket a square plus a b plus b square here where a is equal to s and b is equal to h so we have s minus h bracket bracket a square plus h s plus h square is equal to zero so this is s minus 8 is equal to 0, which is the first case. And the second case is s square plus 8s plus 64 is equal to 0. Then from here, s is equal to 8. This is another value of s, which is also a real solution. And from here, this is a quadratic equation. S is equal to minus B plus or minus square root of B square minus 4AC over 2A. Then S is equal to minus H plus or minus square root of 8 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 64 divided by 2 multiplied by 1. S is equal to minus 8 plus or minus square root of 8 square. That is 64 minus 4 multiplied by 64 over 2. Then S is equal to minus 8 plus or minus square root of this can be written as 64 bracket 1 minus 4 over 2. Then S is equal to minus 8 plus or minus here is 8 square root of 1 minus 4, that is minus 3 over 2. But square root of minus 1 is equal to i. Then we have s is equal to minus 8 over 2 plus or minus 8 over 2 i. Here is root 3. 2 year 1, 2 year Four, two year one, two year four. S is equal to minus four plus or minus four i root three. These are other values of S from the second case. Therefore, our final answers are S one is equal to eight. S two is equal to minus 
S3 is equal to 4 plus 4i plus 3. S4 is equal to 4 minus 4i root 3. S5 is equal to minus 4 plus 4 i root 3 and s is, is equal to minus 4 minus 4 i root 3 these are the values of x you can see that here we have two real root and then four complex root this is complex 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 and this is real and this is also a real root I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.